Sculpting is the most artistically intuitive method for forming organic 3D shapes. Where mesh modeling is primarily effective for hard surface man-made objects like car tires, pokeballs, interior environments, and cities, sculpting is effective for natural organic objects like rocks, trees, creatures, and characters. My name is Ken Trammell, and I want to welcome you to the Fundamentals of Digital Sculpting with Blender 4.2. This is the third time I've recorded this course in nine years, so between the positive feedback and helpful suggestions from past students, you can trust this tried and true curriculum for learning the essentials of sculpting with Blender. This course is divided into three parts. Chapter 1 details sculpt mode functionality, including sculpt brushes, tools, menus, parameters, and checkboxes. It's a lot to go over, but along the way, I will emphasize the most important things for someone getting started. Chapter two covers sculpting formats like multi-resolution, remesh, and dynamic topology. You can think of these as unique types of digital clay, each with their own pros and cons, depending on the situation. And chapter three is the best chapter because all these tools only exist so we can sculpt cool things, like a stylized shark creature. From a digital ball of clay to a refined sculpture, I'll guide you through the entire process. This is where the rubber meets the road and where you realize that sculpting is a lot of fun.